Hi everyone, it's Shannon and welcome to today's video. So today's video, very excited because for the first time ever, I got the Charlotte Tilbury Advent Calendar. I am so excited. They did send this to me in PR. So today we're gonna unbox everything that's inside. I'm gonna show you everything that's inside. Um, I am wearing a few of the products that are inside. Now you, what's inside is not a surprise. It is listed on the website. So if you wanna know what's inside, you can find out. But uh, yeah, I'm very excited. I have never gotten her advent calendar. I have admired it from afar. I've wanted it and this year was, um, I was really thinking about it because not only you know, for the products, but the chest, which we'll go into in a second. Um, and then they told me I was um, about to purchase it. And then they told me they were sending it to me in PR. So very excited um, that I did get sent this in PR, but I was actually thinking about purchasing it because for the most part, um, some of the items, most of the items I don't have, or they're items that I use up so um it's not something that's going to be you know like an eyeshadow palette that i already have there's no eyeshadows um but there are um a lot of good products in here so i'm going to go through everything that's inside and then let you know whether or not i think it is a good purchase um if it's you know something i recommend go through all of that so let's get started so first what i showed you is the box that it comes in so here is the box it comes in right now this is empty and on the back it has all the things that are inside then it is actually wrapped in plastic so it is very protected inside and then this is the gorgeous part here is the advent calendar this is so beautiful i have looked at it from afar for a long time i've always thought it was gorgeous and um but you know you wonder like okay well it looks pretty in pictures but what does it look like in person is this something that i can keep uh it's just as gorgeous in person i think it is absolutely stunning the drawers work pretty well i am probably going to put this in my backdrop um i'm probably working on a new doing a whole new um redoing my whole office to be honest because i'm in like in a tiny little corner so i'm working hopefully in the next few months getting um, a new setup but for the meantime this chest of drawers may be my uh, in my backdrop because i just think it's absolutely stunning it's functional as well but there are some products in here so that's what we're going to go over today so let's just go over the specifics of this advent calendar. It is called um, Charlotte's Lucky Chest of Beauty Secrets 12 Door Beauty Advent Calendar. Um, and it says, explore my world of magic makeup and glowing skincare icons with my new beauty advent calendar for 2023. Charlotte's Lucky Chest of Beauty Secrets. Discover an iconic beauty secret in every jeweled handled drawer to make your beauty dreams come true this holiday season and beyond. Featuring some of my most iconic beauty showstoppers, award-winning makeup and glowing skincare secrets to make you look and feel like a star this is the perfect magic gift for you and everyone on your list now the value of the items inside is 279 dollars this is actually 210 dollars so it's not like the mystery box where it's a 50% off um, you're going to save $69 off the products inside so that's something to keep in mind however I do think there's value in this like chest of drawers because this is something that you can put on your vanity this is something that's very functional the top opens as well so the top can open as well and you'll see um, may all your beauty dreams come true so at the top so this could be where you could put stuff in as well so this is a very functional like jewelry chest that is the value of it. It is $279, but um, it is $210. Now you can use a promo code on these. Uh, I do have a promo code, Shannon F F A 012. It's the here below. Now that's only 15% off your first purchase. So that will save you 15% off your first purchase. So that will save you about $30 on this. I think that's my math. Um, so you know that but it has to be your first purchase um or first time you're using a specific email hint hint but anyway um let's get into what is inside okay so i'm going to start with the top drawer and i'm just going to go in straight in order so and I, I have opened these because they were individually wrapped with tissue paper really nice um i have 
taken them out because it just to make it easier to be on camera so the first item is this collagen lip bath i believe this is in the shade walk of no shame which it is i love these um i do have lipstick on right now so this is the collagen um lip bath in the uh, uh walk of no shame it's gorgeous i love it i've had these before i've had them in i have one in a mini as well because i got it in a little set these are fantastic. They have like a minty um, uh, scent to them and they plump a little bit. Very hydrating, I love it. I'm gonna put it on after we get, because this lipstick is in here as well, so I wanna, I'll put this on after, but um, I do really like these. Um, these are great. Okay, and next we're gonna go to this top drawer here on the top, and this one is really nice. Um, this one has like a little container inside to keep it so from rolling, and this is the Charlotte's Magic Serum. It is a mini size. I also forgot to mention that Collagen Lips um, Bath is a mini size. There's only two full-size products in here, so um, there's 10 mini or you know deluxe sizes, but uh, the rest are, you know, there's only two full sizes, so just keep that in mind. Now, I love this product this is a really great product i have never purchased it though i have just gotten a lot of samples of this every time like you pick a sample i pick this and then i use them on vacation so i use these on vacation it is a fantastic product so i'm act you know very excited to you know have this to really see and get a full you know use it at home and see if i really like it i've been thinking about purchasing it it is pricey so it's the only reason why i haven't purchased it but it's a really good you know product it's a serum i don't want to use too much of it but it's you know um it's really uh it's just a great facial serum i love using this um in combination with other her other skin care so it is very hydrating it absorbs into you your skin very quickly um without leaving it greasy or anything and just leaves your face glowing so it really goes really well with other products of her skincare line so i'm excited to try this that's not in a sample size and see if this is something i want to purchase you know in a full size later on okay next up drawer number three here and it is a mini beauty light wand in the shade spotlight so i do have this um and i'll put a video of me i am wearing it today so here's a video of me putting it on earlier today i love that <laughs> there's a mini on in here um you will see that the one i am using is a little crusty and it needs to be thrown out so i am going to be replacing it with this spotlight one um i I never use that one that I have, so I have the full size again. This is the full size that I have, so you can kind of compare the size. For the um, highlighters, I never would have used this whole thing. You know, I just don't use it en enough. Um, I also like having it um, for travel, so I like having the small size for travel, and we'll talk about that in a second as well. But I think this is a perfect size for the liquid highlighter. I like the mini size. I wish they sold these individually. But um, so I'm really excited to have this replace my crusty old one that I've had forever um, with a nice little mini. I do have this in the um, Disney 100, but I haven't broken it open yet. So now I'll be able to use my mini in the meantime. So very excited. I love this size. Okay, opening drawer number four. And we have the charlotte's magic lip oil crystal elixir this is a lip conditioner i love these i covered these recently she has the two shaded ones that came out that are only available on her app this is the clear one this was also in her mystery box so if you got the mystery box this is going to be a duplicate however these are fantastic the only thing i don't like about them is necessarily the applicator because i feel like you just can't get a lot of product on there and sometimes i like to just not that you can't get a lot of product but it's a little harder to get product on there um but you can get the product it's very hydrating um i use these a lot um they're just i'm not going to break that one open because i do have one and i have the other the other two that are color the color ones are they have color they have a little bit of pigment but not huge difference so they're not um 
the clear is fine. So I, I like it a lot. It's great. It's one of those that's a lip oil that's very hydrating. So some lip oils can actually dry out your lips depending. This one is not, it's very, very hydrating. It, it is absolutely a lip conditioner. I actually use this, I forgot to put it on camera, but I use this before I put my, my makeup on. I use that to hydrate my lips before I go in while I'm doing the rest of my makeup. And then I finish up with my um, lip liner and lipstick. And by that point, I just take it off, but it's conditioned my lips and it helps my lips lip liner and lipstick, whatever I'm wearing, lasts longer. So love it, it's a great product. Um, I do think it's overpriced. That is the full size. So that is um, the one of the full size products. And I do think it's a little overpriced at $40, but I do think it's a fantastic product. Okay, moving on to drawer number five, and we have a mini of the Pillow Talk lashes in, um, it is called Super Black. So this comes in a, a Pillow Talk shade too. I do have that one, but I prefer the black. Um, I just, what I prefer. Now I am wearing this today. So um, now I've only used this a couple times. The I, one time I used it, I did have it run. Um, however, I've used it since and I haven't had it run. So I'm thinking that maybe that was the concealer or the foundation I was wearing. So I am wearing it today. Um, here's some video of me putting it on and you can see it really does make my lashes really long. It makes them last. So it is a really good mascara. Um, I just had it run on me one time. So I'm unsure you know where I stand on that so I've been testing it out again and I'm I actually have another mini so I actually used a mini so this is the one I'm currently using so I'm going to put this one back in the box but I think it's a great way to check you know to check and see if it you know if it works for you because you know some people might like like mascaras and it's a it's a lot of times a personal preference so i um, testing it out again but again good mascara um, and a mini size is a great way to see if it works for you Moving on to drawer number six. I feel like I'm on a game show. And this is the Lip Cheek. This is a, another mini size, and this is in the shade Hot Gossip. Now, I've never had the shade. I have a lot of her lip liners. This is a shade I did not have. Um, I have to look up what the shade is, um, what the description is, but I am wearing it today. Here is some video of me putting it on my um, lips. Goes on, I love the lip cheeks. I actually really like the mini size. They're great for travel but um really great goes great with the lipstick that is in the uh the advent calendar but really great you know great shade and again this is not a common shade of her lip liner so i like that this was put in there because it's not like the pillow talk that a lot of people have so um i didn't even have this one so i thought that was really great okay so i looked it up and it's described as a neutral rose pink so again great versatile i think it's a very neutral um ver universally flattering shade so Drawer number seven, we have one of her eyeliners. So this is the Rock and Coal, and this is the shade, this is the travel size Rock and Coal um, in Barbarella Brown, a mini coal eyeliner pencil in a flattering brown shade. And um, I don't have this. I have, um, I think I have one of her black ones, one of her like neutral shades to go on the waterline, then the Pillow Talk and the Walk of No Shame shades, but I don't have the brown. So do I need a brown eyeliner? No. Um, is this a really good eyeliner that lasts and is a really, you know, again, I like that there's not a black um, because a brown, everybody has a black eyeliner, or most people do. So I like that. Do I need a brown eyeliner? No, but I'll definitely probably use this one more than a black one. I'm not gonna put it on today, but it is, her eyeliners are very good. They last, they don't smudge. So I'm very happy and you know, it's a mini size, so that's good too. Okay, next up we have drawer number eight. And this one I'm, you know, surprisingly really excited about. It's a little travel brush. It's like a little Kabuki brush. It is, let's see, the travel size Hollywood complexion brush, a mini version of my two-in-one multi-use makeup brush. Absolutely love this. I love her makeup brushes. I love this little travel size. Just absolutely love it. This is really great to put on the, um, the, 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 the blushes um so really great i love again love that it's travel size this you can stick in your purse you can use this with so many different things so i wish she sold this because i just absolutely love the size um this is one probably one of the, the things i'm most excited about okay and moving on to drawer number nine we have the second 
full-size product and it is one of her lipsticks in the kissing formula this is i believe the hot lips 2. this is in the shade glowing gen it is a full-size hot lips 2 um, in glowing gen a universally flattering beachy rose lipstick in a refillable leopard print tube um, i already have this so i am going to put this one back in here but i already have this i am wearing this today so one i love these containers because they are refillable um, if you wanted to change this out like if you have something like you really like leopard parent but you don't like the shade you could pull this out and replace it um, you can mix and match with this but it's a really gorgeous shade it's what i'm wearing today love it um just i think it's a really gorgeous and it's deeper than i normally would but it's really pretty i love that's one of the reasons why i love charlotte tilbury's lipsticks because they are universally flattering i can definitely wear darker shades of her lipstick than where normally um i just don't feel comfortable wearing other shades you know darker shades so i feel like her shades are really flattering but glowing gen really great shade and again it's a shade that i don't think a lot of people have so if you're purchasing this in this you know and you don't have a lot of charlotte tilbury products you probably don't have this one okay drawer number 10 and this is one that i think a lot of people will be excited about it is a mini of her beauty light wands the matte blush in the shade pillow talk now this is a shade that's only available on the charlotte tilbury website and it has been sold out i don't know if it's currently sold out but i know it's been sold out for a while i have um the full size i did put it on today here i'm wearing it today but this is me putting it on i absolutely love this shade of the four of the matte shades this is the one i wear the most um i absolutely love it and i have been using it sparingly because i'm afraid it's because it's this one i think is supposed to be limited edition and it's also been sold out so i have been using this one sparingly i love that it's in a mini i love that this is a travel size um because i will definitely be traveling with this one this is a great because it's it's such a neutral shade you can be wearing you know cool eyeshadow warm eyeshadow and it's really going to go with so many different looks so i love this i also love this with the little brush it's perfect perfect for travel i love i this one i'm very excited about and i, I love the mini size it's so cute okay two more drawers to go we're going with the bottom one number 11 and this is a um, I guess a mini size of the original magic cream. So they did just come out with the magic water cream. This is, I'm working on a video on the describing the three magic creams because I love them all. I actually do have the new water, uh, magic water cream. So I'm working on a video um, probably in the next week or so that is describing all three of the magic creams and what they're good for because I love all three for different reasons. Um, but this is the original fantastic. This is the one that's the most rich, very emollient, very luxurious. Uh, luxurious. Um, I love this. I love the travel size. I was just on a three night cruise. This is what I took with me. Love it. It just, it wears well. It wears well under makeup. It is just, it, it's very luxurious. I did get the Disney 100 jar as well. Um, also like that there are refillable. So this is like the, I think the 15 milligram, I mean, I mean, 15 milliliters. This is normally like $30, great size. And it's a great size to see if you really like it. And I will say between this and the Magic Water Cream, the Magic Water Cream, um, I first purchased this size and I went through it really fast. I, I'm almost through it. This one, I, this one will last me longer. Like the Magic Cream, um, the original Magic Cream, I don't need as much. The Magic Water Cream, I feel like I need a little bit more. Um, so just FYI, but I do really love this. This is fantastic. There is a reason why it's won like so many awards. It's fantastic. So it's expensive, but it's fantastic. And finally in drawer number 12, we have one of my favorite products. This is a product that you either love or hate it. Um, I think a lot of people love it, but I have heard people hate it. I think Teresa is dead, mentioned the other day and she absolutely hates it. I think it's fantastic. Um, it is the setting spray. Now this is a mini size. I love this because I accidentally left my mini size somewhere. I can't remember where. I think I maybe threw it out. Um, I finished it. You're, normally what I was doing is you can refill it. And I, I think I threw it out by accident. So I don't been, I haven't been traveling with this because I didn't want to be, take the large size. So I love that this is a travel size. I can travel with this again. This is fantastic. It is such a good setting spray. I like this setting spray along with the one size, the one size like the matte one, but for different reasons. Um, that one's like waterproof, but for like an evening out, 
this is what I use. I love it. It's fantastic. It is one of the best setting sprays. So it's just great. Um, so again, I think in here you have some of her best products, but a lot of the products, like I said, I have the setting spray, I have the magic cream, but those are products that I run through all the time. The um, crystal serum I don't have. So that's really exciting. Um, the eyeliner, the eyeliner I don't have, the lip liner I don't have. Um, the uh well let's try i didn't try this one on so let's get this the collagen lip bath I, I i said i was going to try it on now i do have lipstick on but i'm just going to put this over the lipstick so you can kind of see and i do love this um this color it's a, it's just it's a really pretty um you can wear this with just a lip liner so you can see it but again um it's a really great I love these collagen lip baths and I love that again, it's a mini size, um, you go through them. I go through these pretty fast. Uh, I've gone through a couple, I've gone through a full size of this, of the Refresh Rose. Great, I love this shade. It's great with just a lip liner, but I think it's just a really good overall example of the brand, I guess you could say. Okay, so who, do I recommend buy this? Because I don't think this is for everyone. So first of all, if you are not interested in this chest and keeping this as like a souvenir or using it um, on a vanity or something like that, then don't get it. If you, I think that is one of the values of this, you know, box is this drawer, this chest of drawers, because it's just stunning. It can be used on a vanity. It can be used, you know, as a jewelry box, you know, whatever. But if you're not interested in keeping that, then I don't think this is a good value because I think a lot of the value is in this, you know, chest of drawers. Now, if you do like the chest of drawers and you do think you'd want to keep it, but you already have the lipstick um, and, and then that's really the only thing. I mean, the lipstick is really the only thing that I don't go through enough. I, mascaras, I go through pretty fast. I like, you know, it's a mini eyeliners. So I think if you have the lipstick, but you have, um, you don't have anything else, I think everything else is stuff that you're going to use. Now, if you don't think you're going to use, you don't like, let's say you don't like the mascara, you don't like the magic cream, which I can't imagine, but let's say you don't like that and you already have the lipstick, then yes, it's not a good value. So I think you just have to figure out what the value is. They are selling the mini um, spotlight and the mini um, uh, beauty light wands in, in little sets for the holidays. So that is something that you can consider. So if you like those, you can buy those in one of the sets. Um, I just bought one of the mini pillow talk and the mini pinkasm um, in a set. And they also have, I think one have one of the, I think it's the, the pillow talk with the spotlight. I have to look at it, but they have a couple sets with the minis, which I think is great. So if you like that, then get that. But if you like, if you kind of just do the math and everything is stuff that you, you would use, then yes, it is a good deal. But again, it is someone for someone who wants the chest of drawers. If you don't want the chest of drawers um, and you don't think you're going to use everything, then I don't think it's a good deal. Now, would I have purchased this? I did receive this in PR. Would I have purchased this? Absolutely, 100% yes, because most of the products are products that I go through. While I did already have the lipstick, even without the lipstick, it's still a good value. And um, everything else I'm going to use. I'm gonna use the Magic Cream on traveling. I'm gonna use the Beauty Light Wands. I'm gonna use everything else. So for me, it is a good value. I'll give the lipstick to like my mom or my sister-in-law, somebody, but every, everything else I'm going to use. So for me, absolutely, I would have purchased it again. And now having seen the Chester drawers, yes, I would have purchased it, absolutely. Um, you know, I almost I almost kind of want to purchase another one. It's that gorgeous. So I think it just depends on, this is not like a value thing, like the mystery boxes where you're getting like 50% off. That's not this. This is more, you know, you're going to get a good representation of the brand, a lot of different products, plus a beautiful, you know, piece for your, you know, vanity. But that's it. So if you like this video, click like, click and subscribe. That way you get a notification every time I post a new video. Let me know in the comments below if you will be picking this up. And um, again, try that promo code. It will save you 15% off so you can save a little bit of coin on this if you do purchase it. So thanks everyone. Bye.